Hello. Hello, Gloria. Hello. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Good evening. Pretty good. Thanks. And you? Very good, teacher. Thanks. How was your day? Uh, it's uh, good, but uh, stressful, but good. Okay, so do you work on Fridays too? Yes, teacher. I work to Friday at finish at 5 p.m. Oh, okay, so the schedule is the same. You start at 8 and finish at 5. Exactly. Ah, yes. Okay. From Monday to Friday. And, but you don't work on weekend. Yeah. It's, you work. It's long my weekend. Really? Okay. So you work on Saturdays too. Sorry. Please again. Do you work on Saturdays too? No, I don't work. Saturday. Ah, okay, perfect. What about you, Renee? How are you? Hi. Hi, teacher. Very tired. <laughs> Very tired. Yeah. Why, but, Renee? I call it the middle of the Okay. Yeah. A lot of work. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Wow. Yeah, very late. Very late. Sorry. But, uh, <laughs> but uh, I hear. So you're just arriving home. Yes. You haven't had dinner. Yeah. No, nothing. You're uh, just right arriving. now. Right now. Okay. Uh huh. Well, that's good. Well, nice, but. Yeah. But you don't work on weekends, right? Yes, yes. You do. You work on weekends. Uh, I work 
uh, something uh, Sunday. On Sunday? Oh, yeah. wow. Sometimes. <laughs> yeah, but sometimes we complain about our job, but believe me, there are some people who is um, uh, having more stressful jobs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, I was coming here and I, uh, on the way, I passed through a, like a cafeteria mm -hmm. on the street. Mm -hmm. at about 7 p.m. Mm -hmm. and uh, there were like uh, five cafeterias in a row and one lady was still making pupusas at that time. It was very dark, the street, and she was working in that cafeteria and I said, how can we do that? No, poor people. And I say, I love my job. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. Yes. When I see those people working like that, I say, I really love my job. <laughs> Thanks, God, yeah. for my job. <laughs> hey. yes. Yeah. And tomorrow is Friday. Come on. So you can start to feel happy because tomorrow is Friday. Mm -hmm. We can start to celebrate. <laughs> okay. Uh, how are you doing with the platform? Okay, you will do it on Friday. Friday we don't have classes, so you can have a, uh -huh. mm -hmm. a little more time for that. And you, Gloria? Could you continue working on the platform? Uh, today, no teacher, but uh, I, today in my time of lunch, I study a little uh, the regular verb and the writing. Yeah, okay, that's good. What about you, Rebecca? How are you? Hi, teacher. Um, in the section three, iniciando. Oh, okay, but it's okay because we are working on the section three now, so you are okay. You're doing good. Okay, uh, what places today we're going to start a different topic? I would like you to share what places can you visit around your town? Uh, like for example, where I live, there are two two malls nearby where you can go and buy different things. Uh, there are many parks when you can go and have fun with your family, children, and there are like uh, I don't know plenty of restaurants when you can buy different food. There are many pupuserias around. Um, there are many uh, grocery stores. What about the place where you live? What about your neighborhood? What places can you mention? Uh, <clears throat> place, teacher, sorry. Places in my neighborhood. 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 Okay. Uh huh. Or or around your neighborhood. Okay. Around my neighborhood. Uh, for example, I I I had a, a mall. Uh, the mall have a supermarket, a restaurant, a groceries, groceries, market, Dollar City, teacher, se le puede decir groceries market. Uh, it's like, a, well, when it's a grocery store, 
a grocery, la, cuando usted menciona una grocery store, es más bien eh, comida, abarrotes. Ah, ok. And Dollar City is, is, is like, a, is, is a kind of supermarket or mini super because they sell food, uh, utensils for cooking, um, party supplies. Uh, well, they have many different kind of things. Ah, okay. So okay. I think that it is a kind of supermarket. Kind of supermarket. Okay. I think. Yes. I and I have a market. In a gas station, teacher. Oh, there is a gas station too. Yes. In a pupuserias. Okay. <laughs> Many pupuserias. It's a good business. Okay. Yes. Nice. What about you, Renee? What can you tell us about your neighborhood? Hey, I run my home and uh, malls, uh, gas station too, uh, no more, no oh. more. Uh -huh. Okay, what about uh -huh. you, Rebecca? Um, and teacher, no sé de qué están hablando. Eh, mencione lugares que hay cerca de donde usted vive. Ah, ok. Um, um, que, um, ay, front, sería, en caes. Ok, you can pay the electricity bill. Caes. Ajá, caes. Ok, ok. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Many energies. Ajá. Uh -huh. No sé cuánto. Ok, don't worry. Uh, we're going to study vocabulary. So you can practice, Rebecca. We have, well, we can practice this vocabulary. It's about places in town. In town. Okay. Uh huh. So this is like a vocabulary bank. Mm -hmm. There you can see the whole thing. Okay. Let's repeat. This is the vocabulary that we're going to use for this exercise. Let's repeat. Art gallery. Art gallery. Bakery. 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 Mm -hmm. Crosswalk. Crosswalk. Gym. Gym. Hotel. 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 Laundromart. Laundromart. Library. 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 Movie theater. Movie theater. Museum. 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 Park. 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 Pharmacy. Pharmacy. Post office. Post office. Sidewalk. Sidewalk. Supermarket. Supermarket. Okay, let's repeat it one more time. And okay. then you tell me if you find new vocabulary here. Let's yes, repeat. teacher. Which one, Gloria? Uh, for example, laundromat. La it's laundromat, it's like uh, lavanderia. Ah, okay. Laund laundromat. 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 Laundromat, okay. Uh, and crosswalk. Crosswalk. Crosswalk eh, eh, es uh, lo que le conocemos como el paso de cebra. Ah, okay. Ah. Paso peatonal. Uh -huh. Ajá, uh -huh. también se llama zebra crossing, zebra like the animal in crossing, zebra crossing. Ah, okay. Or you can say crosswalk. 
Mm -hmm. And side of, side of work. Sidewalk is is um acera. Oh, okay. Uh huh, acera. Okay. okay. And this la numero uno. Art gallery. Uh huh. Es una galería de arte. Uh -huh. Okay. Any other? No. For me, no. <clears throat> okay, let's repeat one more time. Art gallery. Art gallery. Art gallery. Bakery. 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 Clinic. 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 Crosswalk. 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 Gym. 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 Hotel. 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 Laundromart. 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 Library. Library. Yeah. Movie theater. Movie theater. Museum. Museum. Park. 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 Pharmacy. 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 Post office. Post, Post office. office. Sidewalk. Sidewalk. Supermarket. Supermarket. Okay, now we are going to use in uh, Using that vocabulary, we are going to complete the sentences. For example, okay. number one, it says, I can see a movie at a... A movie theater. Okay, I can see a movie, and you say the complete sentence. I can see a movie at a movie theater. You can complete it in your notebook. Just write the number and the answer. And then I'm going to send the, the worksheet via WhatsApp. Okay. okay. Just complete the answers. Uh, teacher, more, uh, more B, please. Okay. Um, vamos a hacerlo más grande, pero creo que no yeah. van a ver completo. The vocabulary. Ajá, uh -huh. es que si lo hago más grande. Ah, oh, ok. A little bit. Uh, ok. Ok. Uh -huh. Luego la voy a bajar para que vean el vocabulario. Uh -huh. Comentarle que queremos un director de coro.
No, you can Mira, Jael, y tú no te puedes comunicar con Nazari y para que le digan a, a, a Moisés, para así decirle de una vez que aquel que no se meta, porque ya tenemos a quien va a dirigir a los niños del coro. Finished? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, let's see. Uh, what do you have? Uh, number one. We said I can see a movie at a movie theater. Number yes. two, Rebecca. Rebecca, your microphone. El micrófono, Or... Rebeca. Activa el micrófono, Rebeca. Ok, Gloria. Teacher, ¿lay ready? Ah, okay. Uh, ok, number two. Yes. Yes. I can borrow. Ajá. Uh -huh. Both are from a library. Library. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok, repeat. I can borrow books from a library. I can borrow books from a library. Okay. Uh, number three, Rene? Number three, uh, I can play outside and uh, uh, cross. I can play. I can play. I can play, play outside. Uh, I, I, I can play outside in a park. Okay, I can play outside in a park for Gloria. Okay, I can buy bread at a bakery. Okay, five, Rene. I can wash my clothes at laundry. Uh-huh, six, Gloria. I can buy medicine at a pharmacy. Mm -hmm. Rene. I can see many beautiful pictures, pictures, uh, beautiful pictures, and 
Um, I, I can see many beautiful creatures and and art gallery. Ah, museum. 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 Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, art gallery. Art gallery. Yes, art gallery. Art gallery. Ah, okay. Uh huh. Art gallery. Number eight, Rebecca. Hey. I can exercise and gym. Okay, good. Uh, Rene. I can move. I can my my a little at uh, post office. Mm -hmm. Number ten, Gloria. I can cross the street at a uh, crosswalk. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I can see a doctor and clean. Yes, good. Rene? I can go another city or town and stay a few rides on a park. Okay. I can cross the street. I can buy. Okay, I can buy, yes, some meat. Buy some meat. Fruits and vegetables at a supermarket. Okay, Rebecca. Fourteen. Mm. Fourteen. I can't wait to see um a park. I can buy. I can walk. Ay. Puedo caminar afuera en sobre una, aquí dice on a. Ah, sobre una sería, sería. Uh -huh. Sidewalk. Sidewalk, uh -huh. uh -huh. ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, and, I can, and I can see many old things in a museum. Okay, I can see many old things in a museum. Okay, very good. So basically, that's four places in town. Okay, we have this question. What's your neighborhood like? Mm -hmm. What does this question refer to? What's your neighborhood like? Um, stationary store. Um, okay. Um, what's a barber shop? As you see, the exercise is to match the words and the definition. Okay, barber shop. Match the word and the definition. What's a barber shop? Yeah, so you start here. What's a barber shop? It's a place where you get a haircut. Let us be uh -huh. get a haircut. So you have to say the complete sentence. Uh, start by the question, what's a barber shop? If I ask you, what's a barber shop? You answer, it's a place where you can, where you get a haircut, okay? It's a place yeah. where you get a haircut. Gloria, what's a grocery store? It's, it's a place where you buy food. Okay, it's a place where you buy food. Continue with the next one. Uh, ask the question to Rene or Rebecca. Okay, uh, okay, sorry. Uh, What's Gloria what's asked the question. Gloria asked the question to you. Ah, ah okay. okay. Rene, Rene, what's a laundromat? Okay, this is a place where you uh, wash and dry clothes. Okay, that's the answer. Now you have to ask to Rebecca. Okay, Rebecca, uh, what's a library? What's a library? A uh, library is 
need theater? No, no. what's a library? library? Es una biblioteca. Ah. My, my question is, uh, what's a library? Uh, you know where it is? It's a place where you? Okay. Mm. No, teacher, ahí sí no sé cómo responder. Uh, the answer is here. It's a place where you. Uh -huh. This is the answer. It's a place where you. Uh, the, uh, the, com the complement, uh, for example, yeah. the dry clothes, uh, by pool, by cars and paper, your haircut. Ah, okay. Or play. Okay. ¿Y para decir lectura? No, aquí están las opciones. Ah, Solo dígale, it's a place where you ah, buy yeah. cards and paper. O, ah, sí. no, library es biblioteca. So, it's a place where you borrow books. Books, ajá, ok. It's a place where you borrow books. Books. Book. Ajá, ahora pregúntele a Gloria, what's a stationary store? Ok, what's a stationary store? Ok, it's a play where you... buy cards and paper. Mm -hmm. Uh, for me, by four. No, 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 that's okay. That's ah, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Continue, Gloria. Okay, Rene, what's yes. a tutor? What's a tutor? Ah, okay, uh, see a movie or, or play. It's a place where you. Ah, okay, excuse me. It's a place where you uh, see a movie or play. Okay. okay, now the last one, Rene. Ask to Rebecca. Okay, Rebecca. Okay. Uh, what's a travel, travel agency? Travel agency. agency. Mm -hmm. mm, travel. Repeat, Rebecca, this part is a place where you make mm -hmm. reservations for a trip. Okay. It's a place where you make a reservation for three. Okay, it's a place where you make reservation for a trip. Okay. It's a place where you make reservation for three. Okay, very good. Now, Michelle. yes? Sorry, uh, uh, I have asked, what is the different trip in travel. Ok, travel es, digamos, la acción. La acción se okay. dice travel. Ajá, y trip es un nombre, no es verbo, no es acción. Viaje. Viaje es trip. Viajar, el verbo, la acción es travel. Mm -hmm. Viajar, travel. Viaje, trip. Ajá. Mm. Viajar es la acción, el verbo. El nombre o el sustantivo es trip, viaje. Mm -hmm. Por ejemplo, mm -hmm. si yo digo yo viajaré en diciembre, I'm going to travel on December. Ok. Pero That si digo is... que he reservado un viaje para diciembre, I have booked a trip on December. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. okay. He reservado un vuelo, he reservado un viaje eh, para diciembre. I have booked a trip for December. Pero si digo la acción, okay. que yo voy a hacer la acción, I'm going to travel on December. Okay. Okay, teacher, thank you. Eh, sí, sí me expliqué, Gloria. Sí, teacher, thank you. Okay. I understand. <ríe> y a veces este tipo de preguntas digo yo, es que en español a veces a mí me costó mucho la gramática española, más que la inglesa. Entonces aprender, sí, 
¿Qué verbo? ¿Qué nombre? ¿Qué sustantivo? ¿Adjetivo? ¡Ay, no! ¿Por qué inventaron tanto? Sí, ¿verdad? Nos quedábamos con el náhuatl y punto. El volado se entiende cuando uno dice ese volado. El, bol el guacal que la paila. Sí. Pero, sí, entonces por eso a veces decirle, esto es un verbo, esto es un nombre. Entonces digo yo, porque me acuerdo de aquellos tiempos donde eso me traumaba. Ajá. Pero la, la acción, ejecutar la acción, el verbo es viajar, travel, viaje, trip. La, la, el asunto, el coso, el coso. Ok. Entonces, es eh, trip. por ejemplo, eh, en travels, eh, un ejemplo sería, eh, I, travel, I travel to Argentina tomorrow. Ajá, viajaré a Argentina mañana. I will travel to Argentina tomorrow. Ah, ah, Ajá. Okay. Pero si usted dice, okay. fui en un viaje, I went on a trip, el verbo es ir, went. Ajá. Y el nombre el es trip, viaje. Trip, ajá. Ajá. Fui, de, fui ajá, a un okay. viaje. No, la acción es viajar, travel. Uh -huh. El nombre como el asunto es trip. Uh -huh. Ok. That okay. is the difference. Okay. Uh -huh. hey. It's clear. Ustedes como que se ponen de acuerdo con el grupo que tengo en la mañana, me hicieron la misma pregunta. <risa> y ayer también sucedió. Ayer también me hicieron la misma pregunta de ellos en la mañana. Entonces, sí. <risa> sí, no, en yo, re ustedes. yo realmente hace unos días también tenía esta, esta duda. Pero And the travel que, trip. Sí, yo creo que no sé, en el módulo anterior parece que usted lo aclaró también. Recuerdo que algo había dicho. Mm -hmm. Ok. But sí, now it's clear. Uh -huh. Ok. Yes. Ok, thank you. Yes. Okay, let's continue with this conversation. Okay, let's look at the people in this conversation. I'm going to zoom it so you can see better. Okay. Okay. As you see, there are two persons speaking, mm -hmm. an old lady. Oh, she looks very oh, yeah. fancy. She looks fancy. Wow. Okay. She's wearing a suit. It's very yeah. fancy. And this ear, it looks like a hippie or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Okay, the conversation. It's, I'm your new neighbor. Oh, okay. I'm your new neighbor. I'm your neighbor. Okay. I'm your new neighbor. I'm your neighbor. Okay, let us practice the conversation. Excuse okay. me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I'm just moved in. Excuse me, I'm your neighbor. I'm your new neighbor, neighbor. Jack. Yeah. I just moved in. I just moved in. 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 Uh -huh. moved in. One more time. Moved Excuse in. me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Excuse, Excuse me, me, I'm your new, I'm neighbor. new neighbor, Jack. I it's just moving. moved in. Oh, yes. Oh, oh yes. yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? I'm looking, I'm for, looking a for a grocery store. store. Are there, are there any, any, any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Yes, there are yes, some on Pine, are Street. on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Oh, good. Oh, good. Hey, is there, is there a, is there a laundromat okay. near here? Well, I think there is one across from the shopping center. Well, well I think there I is think one across there... from the shopping center. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. By the way, there is a barber shop in the shopping center, too. By, By the way, the there is a barber shop, in, a shop, in, shop in the shopping center, too. A barber shop. A barber shop. Okay. <laughs> Questions about vocabulary? Um, no. Uh, no. Pine Street, uh, the number. Uh, 
It's the oh. name of, of the street. It's the number of the oh. calle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Clear. Clear all. Okay. Let's practice one more time. Excuse me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. Is I just moved in. Excuse me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I'm just, I'm just moving. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? I'm, I'm looking, looking for a grocery, for a grocery store. store. Are there any, are there any around here? Mm -hmm. Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Yes, yes there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? <laughs> oh, good. And, and is there a laundromat, there a laundromat near, near here? here? Well, I think there is one across from the shopping center. Well, I think yeah, there's I a, think there one across from the shopping the center. center. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. By the way, there is a barber shop in the, sub, in the shopping center too. By the, By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center. In the shopping center too. A barber shop. A barber shop. Okay, very good. Uh, let's listen to who wants to start. Practice, practice speaking. Okay. Okay, uh, me teacher. Okay, Gloria yes, and yes, Renee. Yes. Okay, okay, you can start, Renee. Okay. Uh, excuse me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moving. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some one Pine Street. Oh, cool. And is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? All right, very nice. Now uh, change. You start, okay. Gloria. Change. Gloria, you okay. start and Lene, you continue. I am Mr. Day. Excuse me, I'm your neighborhood. Uh, sorry. Excuse me, I'm your new neighborhood. Jack. Neighbor. Neighbor. Jack. I just moving. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some up in the street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Well, I see there's some across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? Okay, nice. Well, um, another two volunteers. Rebecca. Hello. <laughs> Hola, yo. <laughs> Vaya, pues. And, and, and Veronica, too. Uh -huh, me estaba escondiendo. <laughs> I see. Veronica. Okay. Hello. Me escuchan? Hi. Yes. Y yes. Ah, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. I am Jack. Excuse me. I am your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Oh yes. Yeah. I am looking for a grocery store. Hola. Yeah. Hola. Yeah, yeah. We can hear you. Yes. Continue. Yeah. Uh, I am looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Around? Yes, yes there are like, some um, on Saint Street. Fine. Oh, good. And is there a laund laundromat near here? Well, yes. In the trees, one across from the shopping center. Thank you. <laughs> Be well. There are best spots. There is a the barber shop. There is a barber shop. There is a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop. Okay. Now change. You start, Rebecca. Excuse me, is your neighbor? Yes. 
Jay, can you know it? Oh, yes. I like it for grocery store. Are they any other out here? Yes, there are there are some on Pine Street. Oh good. In a Paris laundry near here. Well, I think there's one across from the shopping setting. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? Okay, finish, teacher. Okay. Since the word around, let's repeat around. 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 Yes, around. 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 Yes, that word, it's kind of difficult to pronounce sometimes. Around. Well, the aim of this lesson is to practice there is and there are, as we have said before in previous lessons. This is to talk about the existence or well, when something exists or what something doesn't exist. Well, we have said before that we use there is for singular nouns, right? If it is singular, we say there is. Mm -hmm. There is, uh-huh. If it is plural, there are. If it is okay. singular, we can say there is one. Or mm -hmm. there is a, right? Okay. When singular noun. And any, remember that we just use any in? ¿Cuándo usamos any? ¿Se recuerdan? Eh, eh. Mm. Mm. Plural. No. 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 No, teacher, I don't remember. No, don't remember. remember. No, no, teacher. Sorry. Okay, uh, don't worry. Uh, there is, y there are, dijimos que se utiliza para hablar de la existencia o no mm -hmm. existencia de algo, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. There is para singular. Ajá. Podemos decir, there is one, para decir, hay un o una, there is a, mm -hmm. for example, there is a pharmacy across the street, okay? There is a yeah. pharmacy, hay una farmacia. Uh -huh. There are, es para plural, puedo decir, there are some, hay algunos o hay algunas. El any solo se va a utilizar en oraciones negativas y en pregunta. Ah, ok. Ajá. Yes. Por el, y el N lo puedo usar ya sea singular o plural, pero solamente en negativa y en pregunta. Por ejemplo, eh, si quiero decir que no hay ninguna barbería aquí cerca, there isn't any barber shop around here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, and other, uh, there are any, <laughs> there are any horse uh, here? Mm -hmm. There aren't any bookstores around here. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. O okay. para preguntas, si usted puede decir, is there any, is there any, is there any library around here? Uh, uh -huh. O si quiero preguntar si hay bancos cerca de aquí, are there, are there, there any are banks bank. around here? Uh, any okay. lo puede usar en singular o en plural, no importa, pero uh -huh. solamente en preguntas y oraciones negativas. 
En una afirmación nunca va a usar any. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. That is okay. The, the difference. Ok, very good. Y al sum es como para decir algunos, eso solo se utiliza en oraciones afirmativas y en preguntas. Uh -huh. Para okay. plural. Uh -huh. Ok, ok. Ok, and uh, for uncountable too. Let's repeat these uh, questions. Cuando sea pregunta, no vamos a decir there is, sino que is there para singular. No vamos a decir there are, sino que are there para plural. Sí, tenemos que darle vuelta para hacer la pregunta, ¿verdad? Ok. Let's repeat this. Is there a laundromat near here? Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. Yes, there is. There is one across from the shopping center. There's one across from the shopping center. No, there isn't. No, there, no, there isn't. But there's one next to the library. But there's one next to the library. Are there any grocery stores around here? Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. Yes, there are. There are. There are some nice stores on Pine Street. There, there are, are some, some nice stores, nice stores on, Pine on Pine Street. No, there aren't. No, no there, aren't. there aren't. But there are some on Third Avenue. But there are some, there are some on Third, Third Avenue. Avenue. No, there aren't any around here. No, no there, there aren't, aren't any, around here. any around here. Okay. Now, Let's review the prepositions. Pronunciation on. On. Um, next to. Next to. Near. Near. near close to. Close to. Across from. Across, across from. Through. Opposite. Opposite. In front of. In front, In front of. of. In back of. In, In back, back of. of. Behind. 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 Between. Between. On the corner of. On the corner of. The corner of. Okay, right now we have just practiced uh, pronunciation and vocabulary. And, and it is time to finish. Ya se nos hizo hora de irnos, ya? And uh, yeah. yeah, it's nothing. I One hour is nothing. But, um, I'm very happy to see you. Uh, we will continue with this topic. Vamos a ejercitar esto el lunes. Okay. So, en la clase de lunes vamos a hacer ejercicios y vamos a reforzar there is, there are some y any. Okay. 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 Study exercise in the platform. Thank you for joining. No se pierdan. Verónica hace días que no se conectaba. Sí. No, pero no, aquí estoy. Ok, hay que ponerse al día. Y sí. so, I hope you have a nice weekend and see you on Monday. Ok. Ok, teacher. teacher. The next Monday. Okay, thank you, teacher. Ok, bye. Take care. Good night. Good night.